Caitlin Clark iced out for her photo shoot with the Indiana Fever. Check out the video. I'm sweating. It's Caitlin Clark. Come along with me. 2024 Indiana Fever Media Day behind the scenes. Augies. Oh, yeah. you all Are they all for me? Oh, no, that's not a treat. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Are Myself, so I have no idea what I sounded like. I could have yeah, sounded like gosh. anything. Okay. Oh god. I'm a really bad artist. <laughs> game? Not game. Smiley person. People should know who it is. No, I did good. I gave you the headband and then I did your hair down, but and I also did a button, so it looks a little weird on paper, but just know I was going for both. Questions. <laughs> Am I Yeah? Uh, <laughs> cool. I'm sorry, I'll stop. I'm feeling good. It's moving smooth. It's fun. We got some fun stations. We got some serious stations. Solid day so far. Whenever you're ready. Hi, I'm Caitlin Clark and this is... Wait, what am I saying again? Hi, it's Caitlin Clark and we're playing Would You Rather. Ready? On you. Oh. Read it, read it, read it. Read it. Oh. How's your spinning? Pretty good. Oh, look, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, -hoo -hoo. Thanks, everybody, for following along. First media day. Here we go. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Cha, cha, cha. Happy birthday to you. Cha, cha, cha. You know, everybody wants to fall in love with the scoring and the long threes. I think it's my passing. Like, I just, I love setting my teammates up for success. I feel like I can kind of see the game develop a little bit um, faster and, you know, before a play even occurs. And I think um, my teammates can see that as well. Um, so I, th I would probably say that part of it. And obviously, I get to play with the best of the best of the world now. So why wouldn't I want to feed them the ball? Um, especially with Lalia. I'm just like, lay up, lay up, lay up, lay up. <laughs> Come on, give me an assist. Let's go. put it as like you know when you go to a, a different school the first day of school you don't know anybody and you find that one person that says hi to you that become your best friend 
Um, for me, I just wanted to get ahead of it because I know this transition is tough, just being undrafted and being a rookie. It's very unlikely that a vet, you know, just take you in when you got the same position. And I think oftentimes people forget that I'm a great person before a basketball player. So for me as a big sister, I'm just like, I'm going to take this first step first to just let her know, like, we're here, we got you. Whatever you need from me as your vet and even you're in the same position, I got you. And she's just been doing a great job with just accepting it and receiving it from me. I mean, Candace Parker has always been someone that I consider a role model. I think she's the reason that I've just loved basketball so much because at her size, being able to do what she does, handle the ball the way she does, shoot the ball the way she does, like someone that's tall growing up, wanting to continue in the sport, I mean, she was just a major piece to me. That was huge, you know, that was one of my role models, you know, the reason I started playing basketball, the reason I was number three, you know, when I was young. So just playing against her and, you know, her giving me tips on the floor, you know, that was big for me. And, you know, congrats on a huge career for her. What she's done for the game is tremendous. Um, she's also an Adidas athlete, so I've spent some time with her. Um, she's tremendous. You know, she's she's changed the game for us, you know, on and off the court, just being able to be on TV and always present, you know, just showing up for the women's sports. And then as the ba the basketball stuff, it's a whole resume of things that she's done to just to kind of change the game. And I'm sure she's still going to change the game with just being on TV and just still being around basketball. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video, Hoop Life Family.